Hey guys, as always, Shazam and a welcome ooh, to a very spooky special Halloween episode. I'm glad you're here. We got it all. We got Randolph. We got Scream and Go. We got the Duke boys. And we got you people sending it in. On Wednesday, holy smokes, I got it right. Did I Did I or not? Did I or did I not? Y'all agree with me. Boy, I got it right. I've saved it again to my favorite to the very end. Let me know what you think. It's going to be a mess. It's going to be fun. And ooh, it's going to be a little spooky. Actually, it won't be spooky at all. I think it's going to be hilarious. Glad you're here. You ready? Next. Let's just get this out of the way. It's from the B, and this is real. To shed their gay beer image, Bud Light partners with sportwear, sweaty men, and underwear hug for, <laughs> for 25 minutes. Yeah, Dana signed on with Bud Light again like he did back in the day. I don't know. I think it's funny. Next. This was yesterday on Thursday was the anniversary. Seven years ago, she posted this. <laughs> Happy birthday to this future president. <laughs> Next. Uh, I see a false flag coming. Not a meme, just a warning. I didn't write that, but uh, yeah, yeah, there's more coming. Next. Ooh, spooky time. Vampires suck your blood for vitamin D because they can't go out in the sun themselves. You ever think about that? No. You only think about yourself, Janet. <laughs> Next. Spirit Halloween costume. I understand not knowing about guns, but have you at least seen a movie with guns? Isn't that bad? That's great. Next. <laughs> That's the spice. Mm, that's why we call it a spicy Friday. Cute couple costume ideas. Drama lava go. All right, next. Hashtag Fat Albert. <sighs> or hashtag Fatal Bert. That's pretty good. One of y'all sent that. Next. Babe, are you okay? You've barely touched your gabagool. <laughs> Over here. Some of y'all get that reference. Next, not a meme. Just shout out to my boys. Hung out the other night. We were all, all happened to be wearing our tyranny shirts. That's Doc and, that's Doc and my buddy Jim. Love those guys. Next. <sighs> Read the part again where she burns her whore mouth on my porridge. <sighs> Funny. Next. If you put holy water in a humidifier, it turns the room into a gas chamber for vampires. Uh, sir, this, <laughs> this is a Wendy's. <laughs> Next. Oh, geez. Spirit Halloween costume. Lori, <laughs> Lori Lightfoot mask. Ah, screaming goat. <laughs> Next. Willy Wonka. <laughs> and the Chocolate Factory. Yeah. You've heard of the Hamburglar. She's more like the Turd Burglar. Sorry. <laughs> Next. Uh, end of week update. Jim Jordan should be speaker, and Larry Vickers did nothing wrong. Yep. Next. Benny Johnson says, uh, we're on the brink of World War III, and this is how uh, Sniffy spent is, is spending the weekend. It's last year, just out there hanging out, cruising around on the beach, wandering around, following Jill around. Next. <laughs> A health reminder to all Democrats. <laughs> Democrat women, it's time for your annual prostate check. Ah, uh, ma'am, lady, go. Excuse me, it's ma'am. It is ma'am. All right, today's episode is brought to you by TacPack.com. Y'all know who they are. Every month they bring you survival items, everyday carry stuff, and brutally tootly parts. The November box, the plus box, that's the big one. It's going to be awesome. Bravo Company USA is partnered with TacPack, so they're going to have an item in there. And if you use the code, a use a code, a Johnny60, you're going to get a grab bag worth $60. Now, that grab bag will ship separately from your box, so get yourself. you got to get subscribed while it's still October. Different level boxes, but they're all fantastic. I've been a subscriber for over seven years. I love them. Use the coupon code. It's right down below. It's tagpack.com. Got to do it while it's still October. November's going to be awesome. Get to it. Use that coupon code. It's down there. Thank y'all. Thank those people. Thank everybody. I'm thankful. You people, thank you for every thumbs up. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. 
Hey, we do a lot of fun things here. If you like what you're seeing, I question you. I really, really do <laughs> question you. But if you like it and want to see more, get yourself subscribed. Thank you. Appreciate y'all. You people. I love you. Next. <laughs> if you don't understand this Halloween costume, we can't be friends. Einhorn, Finkel, Finkel, Einhorn. <laughs> you can do with that little clip whatever you want to. It's a funny movie. Next. <sighs> can I come in? I don't know. Can you? Cursing quietly, the vampire backed away, foiled yet again by the English teacher's pedantry. Can you? <laughs> Next. Girls with Photoshop. Oh my God, I'm going to make my butt bigger. Boys with Photoshop. <laughs> I am Lex, the Viking Lord. Meow. Meow, that's some good Photoshop. Next. Meat Blade's cousin. Butter knife. Golly, what is he thinking? What is he thinking? Get them knee pads on. Next. <sighs> Mother, when your costume is on point, but your mom makes you wear a jacket. Mother, next. So apparently when the cashier at Walmart asked you, why, why, why all the antifreeze? Well, saying it's fruit punch for the trick-or-treaters isn't the best answer, LOL. Got pulled over, got pulled over. Next. Ugh. Patriot Mail, she's at it again. Dating a guy that drives an electric car. <sighs> I hope I didn't get him pregnant. Get him, Greta. How dare you? <laughs> Next. Uh, the boys, they're out. They thought it was a good idea to take a shot every time they saw Taylor Swift in the Chiefs game. <laughs> Rest in peace. Next. DC Drano says, new rule, if you voted for Biden, you get put on the front lines of WW3. If you're a congressman senator voting for WW3, your children must be put on the front lines with the Biden voters. And if you don't have kids, then you must give up your congressional salary until the war is over. Woof. No one who votes on that crap ever has to actually go. Who goes? Poor people. Sort of. Sort of. Next. Jordan says, imagine a spooky haunted house, but instead of ghouls, it's just people who trust the government and get their news from, <laughs> from mainstream media. Yeah. <laughs> Woof. Next. Mariah Carey, knowing it's starting in just a few weeks. She's so happy. Ugh. Next. Uh, my body, my body functions at its highest level when I am eating fresh in, <laughs> in season produce. God, they hit different, don't they? It's like the, uh, it's like the Christmas tree shaped little Debbies. When they're, when they're shape of a Christmas tree, the little Debbies are great, the zebra cakes. But the Reese's peanut butter are pretty good. That and the, the Easter egg ones, Easter egg ones. Okay, I'm done. Apparently it's almost lunchtime. Next. American Psycho says, life hack, carve a pumpkin to distract you from the fact that you're also a lifeless round object putting on a fake smile. <laughs> Next. Hey, y'all meet Scream, big cousin. Y'all meet Scream's big cousin, holla. Terrible delivery on my part. Next. It's a radio star. And there's video. Kids, ask your parents. Next. Your other mom says, haunted houses this year just gonna have the news on. <laughs> Next. Hello. When you're kind of crazy, but still a romantic. <laughs> Is that real? I don't know if that's real or not. I haven't seen any of the new ones. I hope that's real. Next. Hey, you are such a horror. Thanks. I mean, a hottie. Oh my God, I didn't, I meant hottie. Uh, no, you had, it. <laughs> you had it right the first time. Next. The unread messages in my inbox, watching me share a bunch of memes. I got a lot. Of, I got a lot in my inbox too. Y'all send a lot of stuff. I get through almost none of it. Y'all send like five hundred a week. I get like four of them read. Next. Uh, ain't you too old to be trick or treating? Me. 
Next, if you like the things I post, uh, you should try therapy. Next, when you've had a rough year, but you're trying hard <laughs> wah, wah, to enjoy Halloween. <laughs> you're trying. Hang in there, y'all. Hang in there. You got this. Next, me. I'm going to the store to get a few Halloween decorations. Me at the store. <laughs> it's true. Lowe's, Lowe's has had their Christmas crap out for like three weeks. It ain't right, y'all. It ain't right. Next, me just enjoying my weekend. Monday. <clears throat> kind of true. Kind of true. Next, me uh, not today. Not today, Satan. Satan. Uh, <sighs> then when? You never have time for me. <sighs> Poor Satan with his wonky eye. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with that statue. Yes, I know that's not Satan. I'm sure that's Pan or one of the other one of the other goblins. I don't know. Is that Pan? I don't know. Or is that Mr. Tumnus? Is that Mr. Tumnus from the Lion Witch in the Wardrobe? I don't know. Next. Uh, ghosts gonna be crazy in a hundred years from now. Someone's gonna be like, I saw a little boy in the hallway <laughs> in the hallway doing the stanky leg, and then he just disappeared. Parents, ask your kids what the stanky leg is. It's nothing bad. Next. <laughs> Oh, geez. This is a test. This station is conducting a test of the, emer <laughs> the emergency broadcasting system. It's only a test. Randolph, go. <laughs> All right. Also, today's episode is brought to you by these. You've already seen it. Make tar and feathers great again, up to 6XL. That's it. They're fantastic. That's the whole ad. Link is below. They're great. Make tar and feathers great again. Next. Stephen King has a son named Joe. I'm not joking, but he is. One of y'all sent that. Boo. <laughs> Next. If you're ever feeling stupid, just remember that Walmart sells skeletons of invertebrate animals. They do. It's great. Next. Women in the 1600s. Um, I think men. Which? Small rocks. Uh, that's an old reference. Next. Amy Schumer, Sasha Baron Cohen, Chris Rock, Gwyneth Paltrow, Katy Perry, Bradley Cooper, Justin Timberlake, and more signed an open letter to the President Sniffer calling for the release of all hostages taken by Hamas. Okay. Okay. Amy Schumer said to let him go. Okay. Okay. That'll end. That'll end a thousand years of militant bull crap. Yep, Amy Schumer said to let him go. <laughs> Next. There's costume. That made almost, almost costume of the year right there. He's sick. <laughs> sick of these hoes. <laughs> Next. Oh, will, <laughs> will she A, enchant Ariel. <laughs> B, freeze <laughs> Unta Gunta Solo. Will she freeze Han Solo? Or <laughs> C, God, that's good. Ask Mike Wazowski. You didn't file your paperwork. <laughs> Rosalind. Isn't that great? Next. Mike Tyson says, Stop sending me this crap. It's a new movie from Disney. Hocus Pocus. <laughs> Let's get some Duke boys. <laughs> Next. Oh, geez. A little hurtful, kind of funny. Those of y'all that are on social media a lot, you'll get this. Spirit Halloween costume. Single mom on Facebook, Instagram, influencer. Includes three baby daddies with face tattoos and felonies, an OnlyFans account, a long list of unanswered DMs, new relationship status every two weeks. Uh, at least, I gotta, I gotta blur some of that out. And key phrases includes, my kids are my life. Why do I always get played? No hookups. Link below to my OnlyFans. Duck lips. Funny. Next, <laughs> Justin sent me this. Justin, Tupperware after you put spaghetti in it. Speaking of duck lips, <laughs> that great. All right, runner up of the week, runner up of the week. Let me know what your favorite one is. I think this is great. This is a runner up. Let me know, let me know. Let me know what your favorite is though. Next, mm, we got a dirty old pervert sniffing a child in. <laughs> Golly. I got a dude with a laptop and a hooker or his dead brother's wife. Either one. Either one. Isn't that great? Mmm. Drama Lama Go. Woo!
Okay, up next is my favorite of the week, brought to you by Blackout Coffee. My favorite is Blueberry Crumble. It's fantastic. Link below with a coupon code. Okay, here's my favorite of the week. Let me know what you think. Let me know. I just, ugh, 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 ugh. this one's making me crack my knuckles. Nervous, nervous. You ready? Next, <coughs> Maine. Feds, when they see nobody wants to vote blue this midterm. Randolph, go.